My name is Steve Groff, Cedar Meadow Farm. I'm the owner and we're located here in southern Lancaster County. So this is where we have our four acre hemp maze. This past spring I came up with the idea, why don't I plant a hemp maze? And then I thought, well, to do a CBD type of hemp, the stalks aren't very tall and I thought that might not work. Why don't I just use a fiber type hemp or a seed type hemp? that grows taller, that would accommodate a maze. And I thought that would be a really cool thing to do. So we planted the whole maze solid. We marked out where the paths are, the design, and then we've continued to mow that as the summer progressed. So here today, the paths are, are clearly identified and the rest of the maze grew up to its full potential. So there's two different segments to the maze, more one for the small maze for the kids and a larger taller maze for the older kids we'll say and kids at heart and adults and anybody interested. The other reason besides trying to promote our brand is to educate, to educate the public on all the many uses of hemp. People get a really confused. Well, what is hemp? And as you can imagine, the first question we get a lot of time is, is this marijuana? The easiest way to understand that is to take something we're all familiar with and that is corn. We've all eaten popcorn, like at the movies or wherever. We've probably all eaten sweet corn, but none of you have eaten field corn. You see, field corn is developed for the animals. Popcorn is for the movies. Sweet corn is summertime, we eat uh, corn in a cob. It's something that we love to do. All of it is corn. With hemp, or you could say the Latin term cannabis, there's many different expressions of the plant. So with hemp, we're familiar with fiber. You can make clothing out of hemp because there's fibers in it. The seeds of hemp are very good and very healthy to eat the flour that you can make from it. And then we've heard of CBD and other cannabinoids that can be used for medicinal purposes. And then there's marijuana. And that was selected with high THC, which is the drug ingredient of marijuana that gets people high. So you have all those different expressions in hemp. And this is really what I'm trying to do with this maze is help people understand what the difference is. This is why I have this maze. We're calling it a one-of-a-kind maze. It's the first one in Pennsylvania, the first one in the East, actually. We have 11 education stations scattered throughout it. The kids can have a fun time playing in hemp seed, and we have uh, pumpkin bowling. We have tic-tac-toe with hemp and pumpkins. So all these things are dynamics around this maze. It's more than just getting out and seeing some hemp. There's a lot of things you will learn and I think it could eventually even change the way you think about things uh, in the future. So come on out to the farm. CedarMeadowAdventures.com is where you can buy tickets. We're open every Saturday through September and October. Also some Friday evenings in, uh, in October. So check out CedarMeadowAdventures.com. Love to see you here.